It's a boring, balanced budget for British Columbians. That from the man in charge of it, Finance Minister Mike DeYoung, has tabled a second consecutive balanced budget. In it, it includes a predicted surplus of $184 million, despite a growing provincial debt. Aside from more than $1 billion for health care over three years, there's very little new spending in the budget, and medical premiums are going up with a 4% increase next year. We'd like to do more, but one of the reasons we're in the black is we haven't overreached, and we've been uh, cautious and responsible about how we spend. If uh, this budget were an Olympic event, it wouldn't even make the qualifying round. Um, a week ago, they made a bunch of promises in the throne speech, particularly around issues that, uh, that most British Columbians would think are important, around job creation and especially uh, skills and training in this province. And when you look at this budget, it's, an, it's a disgrace. The budget contains more bad news for smokers. The tobacco tax is being hiked again. Cigarettes will rise by 32 cents a pack or more than $3 a carton. That's on top of a new tax hike from the federal government.